Shocking new claims of sexual misconduct against veteran CBS anchor Charlie Rose. 27 additional women have come forward with allegations of sexual misconduct, including 14 CBS news employees and 13 women who worked elsewhere. Managers were alerted of his behavior as early as 1986 and as recently as 2017. Previous allegations against Rose by eight women cost him his PBS show and his job at CBS This Morning. In response to these new claims, Rose told the Washington and post quote your story is unfair and inac inaccurate that's a lot of people to yeah just i don't know it's a lot of come up with a lie out of yeah. nowhere i mean you know erica what i always say with these things it's not just charlie rose charlie rose is an older guy he's not gonna be able to get a hold of all these women there's a systematic thing in place that allowed this behavior to continue over the course of decades and now that we're starting to mention managers i like that i want the people that enabled this behavior enables enablers are just as much to blame as the perpetrators the question is can any of these people ever come back okay and when they interviewed charlie rose second or third day after in front of his apartment in New York City, they said, uh, Mr. Rose, how do you feel about some of the mistakes you made? And he said, quote, I didn't make any mistakes. Bye-bye. Mm. Yeah. Nice there, there's one right there, there Charlie. Right. Yes, yeah, right. So you have to be very careful about that stuff. I, literally, just before I came to sit up here, uh, Roman Polanski was thrown out of the film academy. You know, it took all these years for that to happen. So all these, let's get a, rid of Cosby out of uh, the TV academy. Where's this going? And, and we were talking the other day, and I think you said it, that uh, Bill Cosby is going to be sort of a, a punchline in a bar game. Seven right, like a now. bar trivia. It'll be Because we're going to erase him from television history. So 25 years from now, when all of us have kind of forgot about him, you know, people, generations behind millennials would be like, oh, what was his name? Bill something? Because he's going to be gone. You'll never hear his name again. Yeah. I think when you talk about a comeback, you have to talk about, like, atonement. And you have to talk about the idea that you are acknowledging what you did was wrong. I mean, that's 101. And if you're not even acknowledging it, which a lot of these men still aren't, there's no reason to talk about a comeback because it's not going to happen. Not for Charlie Rose, anyway. Uh, definitely not for him. No. All right.